sort of locked a bit. So uh, again, they, it had been all right for a while. I guess they didn't like the ones of uh, yeah, gonna... you figure it out. I think what I'm trying to say. Every circumstance that's uncomfortable, we're just violating the law of one. And then we wonder why our life gets more and more negative. If I were in Aaron's place, I'd say, especially governments and police, because obviously he has more of a reputation to... That an ego can't be righteous with effort. You know, I want to do all these sinful things. I'm full of sinful, selfish desires, but I'm just going to ignore them and do what's <laughs> right instead. That's what I did as a Christian, you guys. That's what most Christians in the world today are doing is striving and straining i was doing that with my testimonials i was saying i'm good i'm good i'm resisting saying you know doing or or saying or, or and like, stuff like that i'm not i'm not i'm trying to abbreviate it now because I, so you get what i'm saying even though i wasn't doing it intentionally i was still holding back because i knew that not only was it illegal for me to protect myself or to wish harm on others but it's also not right by compulsion but i wasn't yet there that's why i was saying oh i'm doing a meditation that god sends you the karma that wasn't wrong and it's good that i put those videos so i see a time frame when the ego creeps in and it absorbs the energy so it amplifies and it was like a sort of morbid not intentional witchcraft but it was like a an Aikido type witchcraft it wasn't really but for me it was hurting me it didn't it, it doesn't cause me more karma because my karma is in your hands, meaning is my karma is something else. It's learning. So learning sometimes is painful on 3D and God knows the mysteries of that. <laughs> but what you will get, because I am not acting. See, that's the thing, though. It's complex, the karma thing. But he's explaining it more simply. And <laughs> let's move. I'm not uh, doing which step now. And even by default, even though physically, I don't even know at what level my, my health has been damaged by your actions. Uh, That's where you're going to see the karma to whatever level. I, have, I don't no, claim even, to even know. Say, even saying it it, it, it scares me that it's still my ego creeping in. This is where you have to be careful when you have access to power, not force, because force is always bad. Unless it's absolutely, but it, it's, again, these things are complex, but if people don't even try... Uh, and now, like, there's a story with Putin trying to make peace, but he's taking the side of Iran. Look into that on the Internet. And it's trying to show that even though we say we're so much better than Russia and China, how come Putin is trying to bring peace in Israel? Even if he's pretending, let him pretend. But it's a good action, right? Even a good action done out of fakeness is still a good action. But when you hurt someone and you pretend that they deserved it or that they did something to you when they didn't do it, huh? just like... I don't want to say what happened with me and what they wrote. We will use any force to restrain you and evaluate you by force. Now you're going to use any force to force medications on inmates and on children? I don't get that law. I don't get these things that you're creating. And, and it is your own little hell, your own little... Because governments, you're really, really overdoing it. But let's also see what else he says that's similar to me because... I see things beyond what he's saying because I'm more free to speak my mind because I'm already effed. <laughs> he's not. He still is trying to find mediation. I can't do mediation because nobody has the balls to do mediation in my situation because nobody has interest in helping me. I'm not rich. I can't pay people to risk going up against the government, a big company and, and the freaking police. So this is how you know somebody's going to have to take my side, right? Police, think about it. There's always a balance. And, and the way I'm already strong in energy, you see it, that it doesn't make sense if I were, like you say, unstable. <laughs> no, and I don't wish it. I just wish you to learn and love and forgive yourself yeah. as much as I want to forgive myself for having triggered you. And I apologized on the internet. And imagine my brothers, my brother dares say that I'm hurting myself. You know how much karma he's attracting? Oh boy, I, I shouldn't have said that. <laughs> I really that. wish him well. And then we'll stop funding the weapons. <laughs> silly, silly boys. Lies. Oh, I'll call this number. Oh no, no, the police. No, they don't say it. Some people. But this is why. Yeah. I was the just, problem is more... I was just explaining when I try to get help, what happens? Eh, not much help coming my way. 
actually came close to death because of love or love that doesn't find compromise at one point. Like in my case, because of my I don't this is this and is and cool of the police and Apple picks. I'm an angel compared to you guys. Yeah. But that's not because I'm judging. That's it. If you look at the technicality, what did I do so wrong? Nothing. In fact, even on people. But you guys, what's on video and what's in my body, which even my brother now is saying, I'm doing it to myself. <laughs> it's it, it's like this reminds me of when you, do you ever see these things in school when, when these bullies take somebody's hands, they slap the person with, with the, his own hands and say, what are you, why are you hitting yourself? You're doing it. <laughs> like it's, it's disgusting. It's just disgusting. That's all I could say. But that there's no other way of perceiving that. <laughs> That's just logic. If you see my testimonials and if you see the, even the paperwork that you did is all the opposite of what yeah. you wrote technically. So let's go back to. But I couldn't move. I'm laying on my face spirit, in the spirit. I couldn't move. I couldn't move. I was, I was bleeding until God. That's a Southern American Christian. Knew, yeah. It was total silence while I played my case. I told him about all the things that I'd done, all the things that, that's what I was basing on, on my, my good word. And a voice that sound like thunder. He says, your faith is dead. <laughs> your works are in vain. I couldn't believe he was talking yeah. to me. But Lord, I was serving you. No, you wasn't. You served a false god. Then he named you. So did you catch the part where he says, the Christian god is a false god? Ooh, and all religious gods are, are false gods. Are an what I'm See, that's it. All religions are false. But you know what's even more false? And I'm going to end it there. When I said what is even more false, 649 appeared on the timing. <laughs> so what's even more false is when you have faith in your accessories, in this temporary experiential. Basically, they say we're going to put our, even Elon Musk, in some ways he sees truth and he has a good heart, but we're going to be able to put our consciousness in a machine. But even if you could do that, it's just a morbidity. It's just like when you when you hurt someone or you make them sick that they can't meditate. When you put fluoride in the water and toothpaste so that people cannot access their energy. That kind of blocks all emotional and flow. How do I know? Because I'm sensitive to even like a little bit of dust and I get sick. So I know that when I used to even touch toothpaste, I say, what the heck? How come I feel so weird? When I stop toothpaste and I use toothpaste without the fluoride, I don't feel like, it's not that I feel perfect, but I mean, I feel other things. That's why it's like, even now they're saying with this uh, radon, I don't know what radon is and I don't know the symptoms of radon, but I know that a few times I went in a building in Montreal and as soon as I went in, I felt something like, I said, I can't be here, I have headaches. And people say, oh, you're just, an, I, I'm going to go somewhere else and do a, whatever, because I was doing meetings always for meditation and spirituality. And so then a week later, I passed by and a friend goes, hey, you know, I just saw construction there. They said there was some kind of thing in the walls, mold or formaldehyde. They said something. They had to renovate the building because there was a lot of things making people ill. I knew before they even discovered, that's why even the government doesn't know to exploit. You know how much money the government would save? But they don't want to save people because with me, I could replace any, because I wouldn't have to say, is this for radiation? Is this for mold? Is this for pesticide? Is this for uh, even the asbestos, which doesn't, all of them say there is no symptoms. Baloney, CO2 or whatever. Uh, I feel it even before because I use, it's a double jeopardy, even though double jeopardy, I get like, I don't want to say you all know the things that affect me, like even dust bites bother me. It's the opposite with the good energy. Well, it's good in a way that I sense the danger, even at a distance. And that's why sometimes I said, Jesus, Jesus just going near my door, without even touching it, I feel bad symptoms, even before I actually touch the gas or product or whatever. Because they've attacked me with, so I don't want to came to know the details, but I don't want to go there. It's the point saying, why can't they use my ability and even my intuition for their benefit instead of punishing me, hurting me, and getting a shitload of karma? This is my basic question to Apopex and the police. Why not? Why not find peace? We might, our energy field, if me, you, neighbors, police, find a way not to be friends 100%, just not to step on each other, just to live in a bit of cooperation and compromise. Maybe even the big countries will find 
that vibration. Everything we do, even a pebble in a stream, physically you could see it. There's so many theories on that. Resonance field. Why don't we try to be better? Good vibes. Like, subscribe. Namaste.